Simon, two back-to-back -back losses with the tournament getting competitive. What will be the approach for the next two games in order to seal the deal for the playoffs? Yeah, obviously, uh, we came here today trying to regroup. Uh, we've done that really well throughout the tournament. Whenever we've had a loss, we've managed to bounce back straight away, but it wasn't to be today. I think uh, Mumbai outplayed us uh, when it mattered most. I thought, you know, we did a lot of things really well today. Um, you know, the, the big positive was uh, the two youngsters at the top of the order, Patakal and, and Philippi, got us off to a great start. And uh, at one stage there, it looked like we were going to get well on top with the bat, uh, but unfortunately, young Josh got out um, stumped and, and then it sort of slowed down after that a little bit uh, with the wicket. But uh, in terms of, you know, then falling away at the back end of the innings, we looked like we were well set again with sort of five overs to go and unfortunately lost, I think, four wickets in about 13 balls. So from a batting point of view, we felt like we were... You know, on track to get around that 180 mark, which would have been a competitive score. And in the end, you know, 164 wasn't enough and Mumbai deserved uh, the result. But same again, I think with the ball, we we did a lot of things really well to get them in a position where I think they needed around 100 off 60 balls, three down. And, um, you know, we didn't grab our chances there in terms of um, after the wicket, third wicket fell, we, we let leak some, some runs in the next couple of overs and Mumbai got back in the game. So... Disappointing result, but I'm sure we'll bounce back positively in Sharjah.